Hello everyone. In this tutorial we'll talk about x and y coordinates and the reason we need to learn this is because whenever we want to change the location of our sprite let's say from up to down or from left to right we need to change the values of x and y coordinates. Now on the right hand side of the screen we can see the small graph and I'll expand it so we can see it clear. Now on this graph we can see there are two main lines. We have the x coordinate line which goes from left to right or right to left and its color is orange and then there is another line which is the y coordinate line which color is blue and it goes from up to down or down to up. Now let's say I want to move my sprite forward so what I have to do is I have to change or increase the value of my x coordinate. Now if I want to make my sprite go backward, I then have to decrease the value of x coordinate. If I want to make sure my sprite goes up, I then need to increase the value of y coordinate and if I want to move my sprite downwards, I then have to decrease the value of y coordinate. Now let's look at this concept more clear and what I'll do is I'll add a sprite. So here's the ball I'll add and on the screen we can also see that we have these two values x and y and these two values represent the x coordinate value and y coordinate value. We can also see that we have this little arrow and this x arrow means that it's going from left to right or right to left and we also have an arrow for y which shows us that it goes from up to down or down to up. Now let's say I want to move my sprite forward so what I will do is rather than having minus 90 I can do it 100 and when I'll press enter my sprite is gonna move forward. Now if I want my sprite to move down what I'll do is I'll change the value of sprite from 49 to minus 100 and when I'll press enter it will go down. If I want to move my sprite backwards I'll decrease the value of x to minus 100 and it will move backwards and if I want to make sure my sprite moves up I'll change the value of x from minus 100 to 100 so we can see that our sprite moves up. Now we can also see that there is a small dot at the middle of the screen and at the middle of the screen both our x and y coordinate have a value of 0. So if I change the value of x to 0 and y to 0 as well our sprite will come in the middle and this middle location is also called the origin. So in this tutorial we have learned about the x and y coordinate and in the next tutorial we will make a small program which will play with those x and y coordinates. So thank you.